Hi, I'm Ellis Carroll, Technical Account Manager at Logi Analytics. So we're often asked, what are the differences between responsive design and adaptive design? Responsive design allows web pages to dynamically change based on the size of a screen, whereas adaptive design is pre-laid out uh, based on the screen size itself. When developing responsive dashboards, there's a few things you need to keep in mind. The first being that you want to be strategic in how you're laying out your content. Most people view content from left to right. Keep in mind, in a mobile view, you won't see a lot of line charts or bubble charts as they'll overflow as the page cascades inward. It's a good idea to focus on KPIs, tabular data, and maybe a few bar charts here and there. Another good tip is to use the white space within a mobile view. So when scrolling downward, you don't have cards or elements on a page overlapping each other. You want to design with the hand in mind, uh, a larger hand at that. So when end users are using the application, they don't feel cramped or are impeded by the sizing of specific elements. And one way to design for mobile dashboards is to start by designing for the smallest screen. You can scale upward at any time. If you start with a larger screen size design, it becomes a little bit more difficult to scale downward. So it's always a good idea to start with a small screen. 